Hello everybody and welcome to episode number 2 of Factions in Raid MC. Now today I have a lot to talk about. A lot to talk about. And uh, some of it is... Sad. And then some of it is very, very cool. So uh, we're gonna take off the bad news uh, if we go to Home Vault. Oops. You guys could probably already guess what happened. I mean, it's kind of my fault for uh, not, you know, <laughs> securing it like with lava or something like that on top. But uh, it, it was also my fault if I do F map. It was this close to basically spawn, so it's really my fault. But um, you know, whatever. Uh, I'm gonna what I'm gonna show you next is a base tour of probably the biggest base in Raid MC as of now, and King Hobbit is gonna be uh. It's gonna be giving me a tour of the base, so uh, yeah, let's let's you know let's check it out. By the way, before we check it out, uh, I made this temporary vault. Just store stuff from raids. Uh, we'll store it here. So uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, so yeah, let's go uh, check out the base. Then after that, uh, we're going to uh, after that we're going to uh, check out a raid that I got. And I also got 4v1, and what happens is unbelievable. But uh, yeah, let's get straight into the base tour. I'm here at the new base. Uh, I didn't build this. King built it, and uh, King, can you show me around the base, please? Yeah, well, right here we have a couple of players right here that have their shit in there. Um, here's mine, VV's. He's the one that actually built this. VV deserves all the credit, not me. It took him about one day to build all of this. He ginned walls, he, um, did the roof. I, th I don't know how many layers, I think around three. Um, Ron is a guy, he plays around, not that much, but he does play. Jay-Z, he's been playing a lot lately, but not as much. Now, we have tons and tons of potions here. I mean, more than most people have. Now... Even though we have this much, it's kind of bad because the per person that made these is kind of our enemy now. So we're going to have to make these dubs last for a little while, unfortunately. And here is the uh, main guy here, Dan. And so we have one Iron Golem right now, soon to be two, soon to be two. And possibly we will get more uh, zombie pigmen, but it's kind of unlikely since... We both have a lot of gaps now, about two stacks each. And we have about seven zombie pigmen, uh, one iron golem, and I think about four or five skeletons. Skeletons sell for a lot of money, as in arrows. I mean, a stack gives you $400. That's pretty much a uh, pretty big price. Now, up here is going to be our head area. Not the biggest deal, but I mean, it's still pretty cool. I mean, this whole room is going to be full of heads. Now, above this is either A, going to be a cactus farm, or a, uh, um, excuse me, a cactus farm, or some type of farm. If anything, just another grinder. And we have beacons here for us, so we always have strength to regen and resistance. And I'm pretty sure since we're in a faction, we're the only ones that get it. But if not, I will talk to the owner, since I'm a helper of the faction, of the server. I can, dang it and maybe get him to change that. Now up there is where we uh, AFK, mainly Dan, because he's kind of poor. Yeah. Poor little guy. <laughs> yeah, I mean, there's not really that much of this base, but it's very protected and very fun to hang out in and do what we need in here. Do you think this is the biggest base in the server? Um, could you repeat that? Do you think this is the biggest base in the server? As of uh, now? probably... As of now, most likely, but the boy is getting up there. The faction is called Alchemist, as they just uh, ch uh, typed in chat. But yeah, they probably have the second biggest faction, as in strength-wise, so yeah, we better watch out for them. Yeah. You know, as maybe in the future we can have a couple of episodes on raiding slash fighting them. Yeah, alright, thank you for your time. Uh, no problem, no problem. Alright. Yeah.
mirror in the mirror on some non-stop chop Some gon' leave it in the beaver pond The floor drop bars on the top around bars Cause the damn dark guns Trying to beat folk from the to the top cars Come for them Spread marvelous sobbing artists And harder with harder than harder War between Martin Marvin and Polly Shore What you Polly think Shore. I wore the sweater for? Villain ain't a metaphor Got paid and made a slave of my favorite whore who can ask for more? I'm chucked off this paper guy Going around town top down Puffin' stanky tie Well, I got the swag of seven sailors All named Jerry The flow is so scary How we change the game And I put them on our back And I put them on our rabbit And I get them on our back And I get them on our Like Harry Winkle, blue messy, like, like who the, the fuck, fuck is you? Man, I'm like, can I punch the shore? I you can or I do can. Perfect nougat, far from human. Take your pick of pickled sticks. I've seen your chick these naked pics to make her dream of nigger dicks. <laughs> also turn these bitches burn. Cast to the fire. Let's learn from Mr. Burns and your fire. Yes, I can. Driven to manipulate. Fueled by egomania. Charismatic. Sometimes he exuded all this love from his face. But beneath the allure can lurk danger. And he looked at me with shark eyes, just devoid of life. How do cult leaders control the minds of others? And which of them is most evil? Disciples, we're going to talk to you about the most urgent thing that is on our mind and what we suspect is the most urgent thing on the minds of those who will connect with us. Planet Earth is about to be recycled. Your only chance to evacuate is to leave with us.